you guys probably know the bigger scuba diving channels on YouTube. You've got Simply Scuba, you've got Alec Pierce, you've got Lake Hickory. These guys have been around for years. They've got a library of quality content and tens of thousands of subscribers. But I figure while we're all being respectable, responsible citizens, we're self-isolating and staying out of the public and we've got tons of time to kill, I would share with you some of my favorite smaller channels but with quality content providers who are making excellent videos within their own micro niche under the subject of scuba diving. And I thought you'd enjoy them too. Ladies and gentlemen, what's going on? Welcome to Divers Ready. My name's James, I'm a professional dive instructor and digital content creator. And if you're new to this channel, I make videos with one simple goal in mind, and that's to help make you a better scuba diver. So do me a favor, help us grow this channel, make your next dive on our subscribe button, click that little bell icon, and that way you'll never miss any of our awesome content. All right, let's do this. Let's dive straight in. I've got five YouTube channels for you who I really respect and admire, and I think they put out consistently high quality content. Uh, all the links to their channels will be in the description of this video below. So please, let's grow scuba diving on YouTube. Go to those channels, hit their subscribe buttons. As a personal favor to me, drop them a comment. Let them know I sent you. It doesn't hurt our feelings at all. Here we go, channel number one. Good morning, treasure diving fans. Now, today is very important. Today, we're going diving. Back in February of this year, I received an email from a chap called Dave in Cornwall, England, and he was asking me, Dear James, really love your channel. How much would it cost me to have you wear one of my t-shirts in your videos? And I said, Dave, you're from Cornwall in England. That's where I'm from. So it will cost you exactly one t-shirt plus postage and packing. And lo and behold, to my PO box came this sweet t-shirt and I thank you very much Dave I appreciate it and that's how I came to find out about treasure divers now Dave is a diver on a mission he's after locating the wreck of the Albemarle which sank in 1708 off the coast of Cornwall she was an East India Company trading vessel laden with who knows what diamonds gold ruby sapphire Dave's gonna find out he's on a mission and he's gonna take you along for the ride because he films everything with kind of a gonzo vlog style um, self-filming attitude uh it can be quite rough and raw at times i'll admit to that but it's always entertaining and he gets into all escapades and he, he's very raw and he shares all of his trials and tribulations boat breakdowns and bad diving conditions and also his success of finding you know musket balls and this kind of thing and it's just a thrill ride to be along and i'm so happy that i found his channel i'm secretly hoping that we can collaborate or i can at least dive buddy with him on one of his dives maybe this coming summer when i'm over in the uk uh but it's just it's just fantastic fun to watch his videos he doesn't post consistently because if you're not familiar diving in england is very much a seasonal sport so don't expect a video every week from him like you get from me but do go back and check his catalog out again link in the description of this video below and throw him a subscribe because he'd really appreciate your support and if you want a sweet t-shirt with treasure divers written on it they're available through his website link also below hey what's going on guys so i just got home from a day of awesome diving of course here in darwin and it was a really snaky day next up is critter hunter critter hunter as a channel is my new youtube obsession i want you to try and imagine a sir david attenborough wildlife documentary filmed entirely underwater but with the narration from ron swanson off of parks and recreation aka nick offerman you picturing that yeah, that kind of zoological knowledge, but also packed with a really dry sense of humor. I believe that Critter Hunter has a very unique approach to content creation. What Justin's done is he's created a bucket list for himself of critters that he wants to see in the wild. And then he goes out and finds them, videos them, and then narrates over the top of them in that David Attenborough style, but with an incredibly dry sense of humor and makes very, very entertaining videos. Point in case his video on the banded sea crate that he shot out of the Philippines where he lives. I just, it just, if you don't laugh at that video, if you're not laughing at his narration, we can't be friends, I'm sorry. Check it out, links in the description below. Hi there YouTubers and welcome back to another video. My name is Matthias, I'm an underwater cinematographer and filmmaker based here in Zurich, Switzerland. Next up we have Matthias Lebo. Matthias is a friend of mine. He's based in Zurich, Switzerland and he is an underwater cinematographer. 
His channel, of course, is based mainly around videography and lighting solutions for underwater. He does a lot of hints and tips style videos, and he also does some dive travel mod log kind of style videos. I've learned a ton from Mateus, that's how we became friends, not least of all how to fix scratches on my acrylic dome port. Thank you so much for making that video, I wouldn't have been aware of the correct product to use Mateus, really appreciate it. We were gonna collaborate on the Great Lakes video, that has been pushed to 2021, but, but I'm still hoping I can persuade Mateus to come over for Dima later this year if the show carries on, and we can do some diving in Florida and make some collaborations together, because I think it'd be fantastic to work with this guy. You should absolutely head over to his channel. Please throw him subscribe, tell him that I sent you, and uh, yeah, just enjoy his content. If you're into underwater image making, he is absolutely one of the channels you need to subscribe to and get on board with all the content that he puts out because it's super high quality and just packed full of useful knowledge. Next up, we have the International Scuba Divers Club. This is another buddy of mine, local guy by the name of Alejandro Duto. He makes fantastic videos about wreck diving, both here in Florida and all across the world. I know he's covered Argentina and Egypt and Bonaire and a bunch of other locations. But what Alejandro does in particular is focusing on wrecks. He'll go out, he'll do a wreck dive, he'll video the wreck from all different kinds of angles. And then he'll bring it into the computer, into his editing suite and overlay the video with motion graphics. So he'll point out, oh, this deck is at this particular depth or this is a point of interest you definitely wanna focus on or be careful here because there's some entanglement risk or whatever. If you are a wreck diver, you've gotta to subscribe to International Scuba Divers uh, Club. I think that he puts out really high quality content. I'm looking forward to collaborate with him. We've talked about it many, many times. It just hasn't happened yet for one reason or another, but I know it will in the future. Um, but yeah, just a really great library of high quality, useful wreck diving uh, guides. I guess you could call them guides. Yeah, that's what they are. <laughs> And the last channel I'd like to feature is Dive Curacao. Now, it's unusual that you get a YouTube channel based around one destination that isn't just full of cheesy tourist board promotional videos. That's not what Dive Curacao is about. It, yes, it's about promoting diving in Curacao specifically, but the quality of the videos and the underwater cinematography that they've used produces really high quality content. And sometimes I'll just go to their channel and just zone out and daydream with their videos on because they're just so relaxing. So in this time of stress and uncertainty, if you want to take a virtual dive trip, I highly recommend you head over to Dive Curacao's channel. Um, start with their video, Beautiful Curacao Time to Breathe. It's just this underwater segment of a huge school of bait fish just swirling around. It's, it's you know, stick that on your Apple TV or your Fire Stick or whatever you've got. Play it on the big screen, kick back, make yourself a drink and just watch that video. It's fantastic. Highly recommend you subscribe to their channel. Tons of great underwater footage there. Ladies and gentlemen, don't forget to subscribe to our channel if you haven't done so already. We really do appreciate each and every one of you. And if you feel so inclined, in the description of this video below, head over to the five channels I featured today, hit their subscribe buttons as well, and let's grow this scuba diving community on YouTube. I don't really see YouTube as a competitive space. There is so much room for everyone to do all the videos. I just want us all to grow and the sport of scuba diving to grow in general. You know how it works by now. Let me know in the comments below if I miss one of your favorite smaller YouTube channels. Just over here, I'll put some other videos you can watch if you're so inclined. And until next time, my name's James. This was your Divers Ready video for this week. Dive safe, dive often.